Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lydia and I recently graduated medical school. I am also on my journey to becoming a resident physician in the United States. Today I'll be talking about how to prepare for this step one exam and I'll also be telling you the resources I use and my timeline in preparation. So if you're interested, keep on watching. Um, the first resource I use is Med School Bootcamp and I recommend this resource because it comes with a nine-week plan and it just makes your um, study more structured and organized. It also has questions at the end of every week that helps to solidify your understanding. So I finished with Med School Bootcamp and moved on to my next resource, which is UWorld. UWorld is a learning tool and not an assessment tool. It has over 3,600 questions. So I finished the questions. I started off system-wise and then later on, I mixed the questions together. So I did both system and subject-wise. So I finished off with the world and when I was sure that um, I was ready for taking the assessment, the self-assessment, which would tell me if I'm ready for the exam or not, I went on to NBME. So um, there are over 30 NBMAs for the step one exam, but I just did the last five, which I feel is more recent, yeah. So I did the last five NBMAs and then I felt like, yeah, my, my scores were good enough. I did we should be getting at least 70% and above. Getting 70% and above is a 99% chance that you definitely pass the exam. So I finished off with NBME and then my very last resource was P120. So in my opinion, I feel like P120 is easier than the NBME because NBME has 200 questions, yeah, and then P120 has just 120 questions, yeah. So for me, I felt um, the P120 was way easier than the NBME, but for P120, I did usually get in at least 75 cents. Yes, and that is also a 99% chance that you're 100% that you're ready for your exam, not 100%. You're ready to take your exam. So these are all the resources I use. I use first aid, but it wasn't a major resource for me. Like I just used at the end of my preparation to revise and all of that. Yeah. So these are all the resources I use, and if you like this video or if you learned a lot from this video just like share and subscribe bye thank you